Imagine a life where money is no longer a worry, where you have the freedom to live your dreams. Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into the seven stages of financial freedom, a journey that can transform your life. From complete financial dependence to reaching true financial abundance, we'll break down each stage, providing practical tips and strategies to help you progress. Get ready to unlock your full financial potential. All right, let's kick things off with stage one financial dependence. This is where most of us begin our financial journeys, relying on others for support, whether it's our parents, guardians, or even scholarships. You're just starting out, maybe working a part-time job or focusing on your education. What matters is recognizing this stage and understanding that it's a stepping stone to greater financial independence. The key here is to develop good financial habits early on. Even if you're on a tight allowance or have a limited income, learning to budget and save small amounts can make a huge difference down the line. Trust me, those small consistent habits you build now will pay off big time in the long run. Use this stage to learn, explore different income opportunities, and start building your financial foundation. The more you understand your relationship with money now, the better equipped you'll be to navigate the later stages. So if you're in stage one, embrace it, learn from it, and get ready to level up your finances. Congratulations, you've reached stage two financial solvency. This is where you're starting to spread your wings and become more independent. You're covering your basic expenses like rent, utilities, groceries, and transportation, all on your own. This is a major step towards financial freedom. It's about living within your means, meaning you're not spending more than you earn. Budgeting becomes your best friend in this stage. Track your income and expenses and see where your money is going. You'll be surprised how much you can save with a little awareness and planning. This is also a great time to start exploring different income streams. In stage two, it's all about building momentum. Stay focused, stay disciplined, and watch your financial confidence soar. Welcome to stage three, financial stability. You've mastered covering your basic expenses, and now it's time to build a safety net. This means having an emergency fund to cover unexpected expenses like medical bills, car repairs, or even a sudden job loss. Aim for three to six months worth of living expenses in your emergency fund. Having that financial cushion provides incredible peace of mind. In this stage, you're also focusing on consistent income. Whether you're climbing the corporate ladder or building your own business, having a reliable source of income is crucial for long-term financial stability. This is also a great time to start thinking about your credit score, paying your bills on time, keeping your credit card balances low, and building a positive credit history will set you up for better interest rates on loans and credit cards in the future. Stage three is all about creating a solid financial foundation so you can weather any storm and position yourself for even greater financial success in the stages to come. You've put in the work, built a solid foundation, and now it's time for stage four, debt freedom. This stage is all about taking control of your finances and breaking free from the chains of debt. Whether it's student loans, credit card debt, or personal loans, paying off debt can feel incredibly liberating. Start by creating a debt payoff plan. List out all your debts, interest rates, and minimum payments. Then, explore different debt repayment strategies like the snowball method or the avalanche method to find what works best for you. Remember, consistency is key. Even small extra payments towards your debt can make a big difference over time. It might feel like a marathon, not a sprint, but trust me, the feeling of being debt-free is priceless. In this stage, it's also important to be mindful of your spending habits. Financial freedom is about making conscious choices with your money. Congratulations, you've reached stage five, financial security. You've paid off your debt, built your emergency fund, and now it's time to focus on building a solid financial fortress. This stage is all about having a safety net of savings and investments that can provide for you and your family for years to come. Start by maxing out your retirement accounts like a 401k or a Roth IRA. These accounts offer tax advantages and allow your money to grow over time. Remember the power of compound interest? The earlier you start investing, the more time your money has to grow exponentially. Consider investing in low-cost index funds or ETFs. They offer diversification and have historically provided solid returns over the long term. The key in stage five is to create a diversified portfolio that aligns with your risk tolerance and financial goals. 
Investing isn't just about getting rich quick, it's about building long-term wealth and securing your financial future. Welcome to Stage 6, Financial Independence. You've reached a level of wealth where work becomes optional. Your passive income streams, whether from investments, real estate, or online businesses, cover your living expenses, giving you the freedom to pursue your passions, spend more time with loved ones, and design your dream life. This is where you get to call the shots. Remember that dream car or that trip around the world you always wanted? In this stage, you have the financial means to make those dreams a reality. But financial independence is about more than just material possessions. It's about having the freedom to choose how you spend your time, pursuing your passions, and making a difference in the world. The possibilities are endless. This stage is all about aligning your finances with your values and living a life of purpose and fulfillment. It's about designing a life you love on your own terms. Congratulations, you've reached the pinnacle of financial success. Stage 7, Financial Abundance. This is where your wealth has reached a level where you have more than enough to live comfortably and make a significant impact on the world. You're financially free, your needs and wants are met, and now you have the resources to give back and make a difference in the lives of others. In this stage, it's about using your wealth to create a positive impact on the world. Whether it's supporting charities, funding scholarships, or investing in social enterprises, your financial abundance can be a force for good. Remember those who helped you along the way and pay it forward. Financial abundance is about more than just money. It's about living a life of purpose, generosity, and impact. It's about using your success to uplift others and create a ripple effect of positive change. Remember, financial freedom is a journey, not a destination. Each stage brings you closer to a life of abundance and peace of mind. Start today and take control of your financial future. It doesn't matter where you are right now, whether you're just starting out or well on your way. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with others who are on their path to financial freedom. See you in the next video.